Hello friends, welcome to Susan and John MathTube. In this video, we are going to work out a few questions that were frequently asked in the question paper. And the one I saw in many many question paper was uh, this one. Prove that 4JN double dash X etc etc etc. Now, if you want to work out this question, you should be very good with the relation between JN, JN minus 1 etc. There are many other met methods also of course. But this seems to be the easiest method to derive this 4 JN double dash of X. So, what we do is, uh, if they ask this question in exam, we write, we have, you write the relation. Now, the first thing to do is, we are going to create the left hand side in what we have to prove. Okay, so differentiate, so you can write like this, differentiating equation 1 with respect to x on both sides. So what will happen? 2 is a constant. The first derivative becomes the second derivative and the right hand side will become jn minus 1 dash x minus jn plus 1 dash of x. Okay. Now once more I told you we are creating the left hand side of what we have to prove. Everything looks, looks okay but here we have a 4. Come on, that's very easy. Multiply throughout by 2. So what is 2 into 2? 4 jn double dash x is equal to 2 jn minus 1 dash x minus 2 jn plus 1 dash of x. So you can be a little bit happy because you found the left hand side of what we have to prove. Okay, so I'm going to paint it in yellow. Okay, I'll do one thing. I'll color it completely in yellow. And I'm going to call it equation number. Okay, now I want you to focus on the right hand side. So in right hand side, can you see n minus 2, n plus 2, etc. Okay, that's very easy. So I'm going to bring that right hand side. Now is the twist in the problem. So look at this. What I'm going to do is, I'm going to consider the two terms of equation 2. Now I want you to look at equation number 1 properly. Oh, they both look same. But are you able to see that our n is being replaced with n minus 1? Don't you feel that n is replaced with n? 2 is the, jn dash is the, but wait a minute, it's not jn, jn minus 1. And if you look at the next term, you'll understand that Ah, there is, it's, a, it, it's kind of like same, but n is being replaced with n plus 1. That's it, that's it. The minute you realize it, you'll be able to solve this problem. Okay, so what I'm going to do is, I'm going to put, or I'm going to replace, that'll be the better word, replacing n with n minus 1 in equation 1. So what will we get? Come on, come on, come on. What will we get? 2 j n minus 1 dash of x is equal to j. What is n minus 1 minus 1? n minus 2 of x minus what is n minus 1 plus 1? n of x. That is my equation number 3. Now what should I do for the second term? Of, yeah, okay. So I'm going to write the same dialogue, replacing n with n plus 1. n with n plus 1 in equation 1. So what will I get? 2j n plus 1 dash of x is equal to, tell me what will happen if I replace n with n plus 1? n plus 1 minus 1, that will be j n x minus n plus 1 plus 1, that will be j n plus 2 of x, that will be equation number. Now. It's almost done. It's almost done. Now all you have to do is you have to plug in equation 2 and uh, sorry equation 3 and equation 4 into equation number 2. That's it. So uh, you can write replacing the right hand side of equation 2 using equation 3 and 4. So we get 4j n double dash of x. What should I write instead of this? 
jn minus 2x minus jnx minus bracket jnx minus jn plus 2x that's it uh, you're going to get the same thing because you, you, this will become positive and these two will get minus 2 so I'm leaving it for you okay now another question that I saw that's very easy uh, but in examination maybe you have to derive it okay so they are asking prove that j 1 by 2 x whole squared plus j minus 1 by 2 x the whole squared is equal to 2 by pi x okay so in examination in case they ask this question the first thing to do is you to prove or find the value I have already given a, a video for that and you'll end up with root under 2 by pi x into sin x and similarly j minus 1 by 2 x you can derive it will take 2 minutes 2 minutes so 4 minutes and you can find these values cos x now this is literally nothing come on square this so what will be the left hand side 2 by pi x and that will be sine square x plus 2 by pi x and the next one will be cos square x so 2 by pi x comes common and sine square x plus cos square x will become 1 so the answer is 2 by pi x and another problem they asked related to the same values is they want you to prove j minus 1 by 2 x uh, is equal to j 1 by 2 x times cot x come on look at this this is sin x this is cos x so you can clearly understand what have ha what has happened what is cot x cot x is cos by sine so that tells me I have to divide equation 2 by 1 because I want to create cos by sine yeah so all I have to do is I have to do equation 2 by 1 so j minus 1 by 2x divided by j 1 by 2x is equal to these two will get cancelled cos x by sin x is cot x and that's it so I'll be back with more videos in the relations of Bessel functions so till then my friends bye